One man hiked 1,000 miles along the East Coast to honor those who died in the 9-11 attacks. WBRE 28, WIU 22. Eyewitness News reporter Jasmine Allen tells us more about his journey and how the proceeds will help first responders. Yesterday was a rough day. Hiked about 11 miles. 10.5 of it was on rocks and through boulder fields. I got it finished up about 4 o'clock and I was done. Nearly four months and 1,000 miles later, 70-year-old Walter Lutz has completed his journey. The retired veteran wanted to honor the upcoming 20th anniversary of the 9-11 attacks, so he hiked and raised money for the Culpmont Fire Department to get a new fire truck. All donations are sincerely appreciated. Don't have to be a big donation, they add up. 1,000 miles through the Appalachian Mountains was anything but easy. Walt suffered an injury, had a run-in with bears and a rattlesnake, and caught COVID for the second time. But none of this yeah. could slow him down. Went to the VA, was having some gastronomical distress, said you got COVID as the second time after I got the shots. Took a day off, got back out on the trail, and let it rip. Walt was able to finish the hike before September 11th and couldn't have done it without the kindness of strangers. I am not exaggerating. They saved me. Young man in Virginia heard my story, had no money. He gave me his lucky dollar Sequoia coin as a good luck piece. Even through the challenges, Walt says it doesn't compare to the sacrifices made by first responders. They gave all. And they give all every day. And I want us never to forget that. In Culpmont, Jasmine Allen, 2822 Eyewitness News. Boy, a nice story. So far, Walt has helped raise $5,000 of his $25,000 goal for a new fire truck. To learn more about donations, just head on over to our website, pahomepage.com. Well,